Big 12 opponent in week two, so they have a lot of confidence. And we are underway at BC. Short kick taken by the up man at the 25-yard line. Out across the 30 to the 35, and that's good field position for Boston College. So BC will go with one tailback. Here's the jet sweep to the wide side. Ben Glines on the carry. The bugaboo for this Boston College offense, getting behind the sticks, you get a little bit tricky here on second down. You have a nice gain on first down, but now you're back to third and 10. Down now and 10, and third down has been tough for BC, 114th in the country. Quarterback keeper across the 40-yard line is going to take it up to the 44, but is going to be a yard shy of the marker. So on fourth and one at their own 44 in their first possession, BC going for it. Dylan, and he stopped in the backfield. And the chips are going to hold and have great field position. You'll see number 17 come in here and just stand him up, and he's not going anywhere. Get a little help there in the back end. Here comes the blitz. Central Michigan beats it. Pass is complete. Nine yards for Boston College. Coming out in a power eye. Did he get back to, did he get, no, it's a safety. Safety has been ruled, and Central Michigan's got a quick 2-0 lead. Take a look. It's Amari Coleman, the corner. Yep. Who comes in on a corner blitz and knifes down the back in the backfield, and he just can't get out of the end zone. Watch number seven right there from the right of your screen as he knifes in there. Those picks have come in the last two weeks. Third and ten. Morris to throw again, and here comes the pass rush. And BC with their first sack of the afternoon. And the chips will punt. Sheldon line drive kick. This is returnable. Caught on the fly. Midfield and more to the outside. Trying to turn the corner. Walker inside the 20, inside the 10. Going for the pylon. And he stepped out of bounds at the five-yard line. It's going to be first and goal for BC. Speed. And Central Michigan's just caught off guard. We're talking about a guy who already runs a 4-5, 40-yard dash. And when he catches that football, he is off to the races. You're going to see right here at about the six-yard line, he steps out. In the ACC in punt return yardage. Handed the ball right up the middle, tumbling into the end zone. Touchdown, Boston College goes John Hilleman. See the physicality of this run. It's a trap play up the middle, and Hilleman just punishes the defender right there. Willie. And we've already seen him. Jet sweep. BC defense does a nice job to turn it back inside, but they push the pile forward. It's going to be a first down and more. Still no whistle. Out beyond the 40 to the 42-yard line. Third down now. Harris throws. Nearly intercepted. He's back at the 10-yard line to receive this punt from Jack Sheldon. And it's another line drive kick that's returnable from the 12-yard line. Across the 20. Here he goes again. Open field. 40. 45 and brought down at the 47-yard line. Turn. Look at 99. Giving him a little something with some physicality. Four wide receivers trips to the bottom of your screen. Here's Brown. Flip over the middle, and that pass is going to be caught, and that is a first down. Brown to throw again. Now he's going to tuck it. He's going to run it fighting for yards and is going to work his way all the way down to inside the 35-yard line, but it's going to be fourth down and about three for B.C. Low snap. Brown controls it. Throws. Passes incomplete. At the 14-yard line, flag is down. Second down and five. Nose of the football just outside the chips 15. This is Dillon, and Dillon untouched to the end zone. Touchdown, Boston College. from the freshman running back. This play is a counter designed to go to the left, and he just sees the hole open up to the right. Now he comes in motion to the wide side. Morris rolls to the short side, throws, pass is caught in no. Check it. Out of bounds, incomplete. It'll be fourth down. For a young quarterback, so difficult to go through that, and they said he came out of it just fine. Well, you saw that graphic about third down. has really been a danger zone for BC all year long. Central Michigan. 0 for 4 on third down today. 
Harris to throw again. He had him. Yeah, had single coverage, but just could not get the ball to his receiver. Brown takes a snap. Pass caught. It's going to be a first down out to the 19-yard line. Nice catch in there by Tommy Sweeney, the junior from Ramsey, New Jersey. Dob, watch number six in the slot right here. He passes off the receiver and cuts in front. Well, you go in front, you better get two hands on the football, and he doesn't That's do it. Dangerous quarter. throw from Anthony Brown, but it ends up in a first down. Brown from the gun. They'll empty the backfield. Trips to the bottom this time. Brown looks that way. They're going to try to set up a screen for the center of the field. And Sweeney is brought down at the 26-yard line, and BC is going to have to punt. From the 38-yard line. Second level and more, and there goes Gilly. Gilly takes it all the way down to the BC 29-yard line. It's a 33-yard gain, longest of the day for Central Michigan. Morris going to roll. Pass is caught inside the 20 and bumped out of bounds at the 16-yard line. Heels. I like this play call. Yeah, Ward can line up in the backfield. Yep. He lines up as a flank. Bottom of your screen, number 12, isolated here. Quarterback keeper. And you just can't do that against this fast defense on at the bottom of your screen. Morris pass inside the five yard line. That pass is caught. It's going to be first and goal. Able to slip that ball in there to Chapman goal. Well, this is old reliable. This is a good throw. He knows he's going to go there. Really gets the ball, powers into the end zone. Touchdown Central Michigan. So Gwilly is in for a one yard touchdown run and the chips get a little closer. The end zone, pretty good block there from 70 Shakir Carr, who's back in well, this week. It, it speaks volumes to the character of John Hilleman. Third and five, Central Michigan rushing four. There's the flip, flag is down. And the receiver is gonna be brought down shy of the marker, so it's gonna be fourth down and two. Morris, high snap, able to control it, and then rushes forward. I think he may have the first down at the 16-yard line. Six minutes to play until halftime. Blitz coming. Here's Morris right into the teeth of it. Throws. Ward is able to get away from one defender, but then the help arrives, and he'll be brought down far shy of the marker. A conversion attempt to make the score a rather odd-looking 14-8. Sheldon, Walker on the fly, inside the 30, 25, and is going to take it all the way down to the 18-yard line. Another out seven, make it the 17-yard line, another great punt return for Walker. And that one play on special teams, so he's got to be killing himself right now. 131 yards in punt return yardage for Walker and end goal. Hilleman. Easily into the end zone for the Boston College touchdown. And then today again, and then the unsportsmanlike conduct penalty gets them inside the red zone, and then Hilleman. Every time he's come into the game, he's carried the ball, or they've stayed on the ground. There he goes, quarterback keeper again. This time finds some room across the 45, and is going to be bumped out of bounds near midfield on second and 10. Harris to throw again right down the seam and that pass is going to be picked off at the 25 yard line pass is intercepted for Boston College the interception from Shane Morris and BC's got the football back looking to add to a 21 to 8 lead Brown to throw again no play action this time now he's going to be flushed out of the pocket it's going to be brought down brought down by Mike Dana in here off the edge, and it's tough to corral a quarterback who's mobile like that, but you stay at home, you stay patient, you come up with a big play. One teammate is designated to wear 21 every week. To the wide side, knocked away, good defense up at the 39-yard line. Never forget what Derek Nash has meant to that program, and, and certainly doing this jersey tradition is a big deal. Bonamigo's a cancer survivor as well. Third down, they click for a first down to the 46-yard line. Brown to throw again, going to crank it up. Checks down, incomplete. Got to believe this one is going to the end zone. Fourth and a dozen. Yeah. 
Intercepted in the end zone. No, knocked away. Not held. It was 42 yards against NIU. That's returnable. Here we go. Coleman going to bring it out. Flag is down, and he is down at the 21-yard line. The top on second down. Corner and blitz. Nine. And he does throw a ball and puts a good put ball to the wide side and driven out of bounds near the sticks up at the 35-yard line. Back run. I like that. Jet sweep. And cutting it back up inside is Ward, and Ward is going to take it near, and he does have another Central Michigan first down just across the 45-yard line of the chips. Morris to throw again. Another swing pass to Ward. That's your go-to guy, and they're going to get safety help over top. Chips 2-9 and nine on third down this afternoon. Contact at midfield, no call. He's got 11 carries on the day. I've got him unofficially at 38 yards rushing. Here he comes again, and he has a first down up at the 24-yard line. So right now, that Boston College offensive line firing off. Brown, pass is caught, spinning, midfield, and bumped out of bounds at the Chips 47-yard line. Get going, you know, five yards on first down, second down, five yards. And there you go again. This is when the offense really starts to get clicking. On the ground again, first down for Dillon. He's got a touchdown run. Still on his feet inside the 10-yard line. It's going to be first and goal for Boston College near the 8-yard line, A.J. Dillon. With much fiercer competition, bigger guys. These are grown men out here on the field now. Here's Brown on the rollout. Touchdown. Hilleman, his third touchdown of the day. It's an easy throw. You move the pocket. Brown on the move, pulling offensively to get a spark. Morris, the lefty to throw, and the pass was intended for Pulgin, and a flag comes in late. Be intercepted. Central Michigan came into play, converting 28% of their third down attempts. They're 2 of 10 today, and that depends on the spot. That may be a conversion. you got to sprint your butt all the way out there and try to make a tackle, so try to wear those guys down a little bit. Hand off to Ross. And Ross is close to a first down at the Eagle 41. Shane Morris back to pass, no play action this time. Steps up in the pocket, hit as he throws. Is that going to be rolled an interception? Yes. Yes, it will. Zach Allen. He said, you better get his butt back out here. There's Dylan. Dylan down to the chips 45. First down at the Central Michigan 40-yard line as they keep the ball on the ground, keep it rolling. Dylan breaking tackles, <laughs> and that's going to be a little more than a first down pickup of 11. All seven plays of this drive have been on the ground. Well, they keep it there. Rolling, throwing, pass knocked away at the nine-yard line. More action, but he sees a really good player. Lichtenberg with a 29-yard field goal attempt. Hits the post. Hits the upright. No good. Third and nine. Boy, nice adjustment on the ball. That's going to be a first down up at the 36-yard line. A really nice catch by Jonathan Ward. Cam Moore, the, the captain for Boston College, and he adjusts the football. Be eight to eight. Chips with a football. Wow. And Holgen, the quarterback, the backup quarterback, we've seen him carry the football. We've seen him be used as a wide receiver. One-handed grab down at the BC 35. At the bottom part, portion of your screen as they line up with four wide receivers. Morris, he's looking for Pulgin again. And he's got it again for another first down in the red zone down to the BC 16. Show, how about this? Again, back shoulder throw. I'll tell you, for a, a guy who plays quarterback, I mean, that is about as good as it gets. Third and 11. Shane Morris. Looking. Pass is incomplete. It would have been a first down at the four-yard line. This will be a 35-yard attempt, and it will come from the right hash. And he missed it, tried to hook it in, and it stayed to the outside of the right upright. Season high, 187 rushing yards for Boston College today. Dylan again. Look at him carrying two tacklers. 
and he's very close to the first down up at the 30-yard line. Dave, I think the rain's starting to pick up a little bit here. Yeah, a little bit. Morris, and he is sacked back at the 16-yard line. Loss of six, second down and 16. Morris to throw again. The pocket is good this time, and he delivers a, a strike up to the 40-yard line. Who else? <laughs> Poljan, his third catch. I, I don't know why this guy's not just playing receiver full time. Morris swings it out. Reception is made for a first down at the BC 47-yard line. 5 of 14 on third down attempts today. Morris throws, pass caught. First down at the 35-yard line, able to get it to Chapman to move the chains. After they take on Ohio on the road in Athens, and that pass is intercepted. Pass is intercepted. And that's going to be the second interception of the day for Dennis. And Dennis wants to take it to the house. He's dragged down from behind, but not before he gets around the Chips 27-yard line. At five, I imagine he's climbing the charts and trying to become the nation's leading Interception man, Lucas Dennis, former cornerback, one of the best players in this secondary. Here is Morris, and he is dragged down. This is just unfair. Yeah, Landry's it, a handful, isn't he? I mean, it is unfair. I'm just watching Landry the entire play. I mean, folks, just watch number seven every snap here. His, he just teeing this thing up. Morris throws. Nearly intercepted at the 45-yard line. Morris to throw again. Boy, into double coverage. The ball's knocked away, and the ball's going to go over on downs. Sets BC up in great position to go for the knockout blow here. Ball's out. Ball is out. And it's picked up by the chips. Brionis makes the fumble recovery, and Central Michigan gets the ball right back. You can see the numbers, season high rushing yards for BC today, over 200 yards on the ground. Dylan again, and he's got the first down. Dylan, ball's loose. <laughs> and recovered again by Central Michigan inside the five yard line. Same guy. Brionis with another fumble recovery. Final seconds of the game coming, coming now. And Gilly takes it out beyond the 15-yard line to the 17-yard line for a first down.